and wound up in war. You see, what I'm trying to get across to you is on this journey of life that we're going on, don't wind up in hell because of something going wrong. You see, this power seat that we think we're sitting on, God's the only one that has the power, and he's sitting on the throne, and he's intercessing for you and I. How do you know he's intercessing? Because the Bible says that Jesus went back to the Father. He's sitting at the right hand, intercessing for you and I. Oh, praise God. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Who is, who is this man? This man is called Jesus. Uh, he is called Jehovah. Uh, he is called uh, the Savior. Uh, he's called the Creator. Uh, he's called a Judgment Judge. Uh, that's who I'm talking about. Uh, I'm talking about the source uh, of power that we have. Uh, the what little bit of power we've got. Uh, God has given it to us. Uh, we might have power uh, that we can take somebody's life. Uh, but let me tell you something else. Uh, we don't have the power to give life. Uh, God's the only one uh, that can give life. Uh, and when he gives life, uh, let me tell you something, folks. Uh, it's well worth uh, to walk down the road. Hallelujah. 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 You see, Jesus, thank you, Lord. sometimes the doctor says, there ain't no time left. Yeah, but they don't know it all. You yeah. haven't been down a word God has told you. Look at here. Your soul is going to be required of you today. We don't know when God's going to call us home. But the one thing that we can do is to make sure that when he calls us home, that we're ready. Yeah. Amen. We're ready. Amen. Hallelujah. Well, Andrew said he's going to have one in Kentucky next week. He ain't gonna just go out and get in that dog truck and leave him and sit today. Come on, baby. Come on. I don't know that none of us here sitting here this after this morning is not going to die today. Amen. But let me tell you something to do know that you've had plenty of time to get ready. Amen. You've had plenty of time to prepare Amen. and get ready for Amen. God's calling. And if you hadn't gotten ready, it's your fault. It's going to be on you. I hear so many people say, but God will allow such and such to go to hell. But let me tell you something, folks. God ain't never sent nobody to hell. The person that sent that person to hell is that person that's sent. You can't send me, I can't see you. Preach it, bro. Oh, preach it. Yeah. Huh? Have time yeah. away, Lord. Have time away. In this final judgment that, that Jesus, oh, God. Jesus and God's going to be doing, Praise that's God. the final sign of power. Mm -hmm. Old brother John said, he said, I looked up and I saw a new heaven yeah. and a new earth was coming yeah. down oh, because the old heaven yeah. and the old earth had been passed away. Now, let me tell you something. God knows how a big heaven's going to be. He knows what the perimeters of it is. And I, I don't know what the perimeters are, but I do know that he's going to prepare a place for me in that city. Amen. Oh, That's what I'm looking forward to. Huh? I'm looking forward to that. It's going to be the final summons. Now, let me tell you something. You you do something here and, and do something wrong, and you have to go down and see the judge, and he'll say, look at him. We're going to delay the summons of what we're going to prepare do to you. We're going to give you a break. We're going to let you off for a little while. But don't do nothing else. If you don't do nothing, you get away free with it. But let me tell you something, folks. You're going to get a free. You're not going to get away free from God. If you've done nothing, you're going to get nothing. If you want to repair, I mean a reward, you got to do something for God. you got to get up and be about your father's business. That final summons is going to be. Depart from me, you work a little bit. When that happens, when that happens, it's going to be gone. Come on, come it's on. going to be banished from the universe. Amen, amen. Banished. You know what banished means? That means you're extinct. You're wiped away. Amen. You know, I, I, I saw something the other day. 
uh, on, on TV that said that uh, uh, we were beginning to find some animals that had been extinct for thousands of years. Uh, they were beginning to, to reappear on the, on the earth. Uh, but let me tell you something, folks. Uh, if they were reappearing upon the earth, uh, they hadn't been extinct. Uh, but let me tell you something. Uh, a lot of places, uh, a lot of churches, uh, uh, they have put God uh, on the shelf uh, and made him extinct. Uh, but let me tell you something. Uh, I want to know. Uh, did I just serve a true and a living God? Uh, I serve a God uh, that's all alpha and omega the beginning yes. and the end. past wicked is going to die that second death uh, and they're going to all be grouped together uh, and they're going to be dumped into hell uh, and hell's going to be locked uh, uh, who's going to do the locking uh, uh, Jesus Christ is going to do the locking uh, uh, preacher how do you know that uh, it says in my Bible uh, uh, that he has the keys uh, to death, hell and the grave uh, that's how I know uh, that he's going to do the locking uh, uh, he's going to be the keeper of the keys uh, aren't you glad that your sisters and brothers uh, don't have the keys uh, and don't have a keeper of the keys. I'm glad I serve one that has a key. Huh? Ain't looking, ain't looking to sneak in. Ain't looking to break a window to get in. I'm gonna walk in.
Jesus comes back, I can meet him in the air. And when I meet him in the air, I'm going to be changed in a moment of awakening of the Lord. I won't have no more colds. I won't be sick anymore. I won't hurt anymore. I'll be walking the streets of gold and singing harmonious jubilee song. Yes, That's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Folks, I feel good this morning. Amen. I felt bad all the week, but I sure feel good this morning. Amen. I got something to look forward to. Yes. And if this is the last sermon that you hear me preach. Come on. Come on. Praise Don't God. drag around. Mm -hmm. You better come on. Because I'm gone. I'm looking forward to that day. The older I get, the more I look forward to going home. Amen. Amen. The more I look forward to going home. God's coming. He's coming. I don't know when. I don't know where. And I don't know how. But I know he's coming. And he's coming back to get his church. To get his to get his bride. To get his bride. Can't you just hear old brother Nehemiah? Mm -hmm. When he says, 